It's the time for Famicom Clone System Review. Hey, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the Wicked Gamer and Collector. So in today's video, we are going to talk about the Play Computer SP30, or Game 30. This is a clone NES or clone Famicom. I did some reviews about these kind of Famicom clones. I came across this thing second hand and I just needed to show you here on the channel. And I just wanted to do this unboxing. It comes in two different colors, we have the red and the blue one, and I have no clue which version it is. As the packaging says, oh yeah, it says the red version. Oh. All right, so let's do a little bit of unboxing. Let's see what we're going to get. All right, so I must say with the clones, you know, it's always the question, are they still working after all of this time? Because sometimes you're just freaking dead on arrival. All right, so let's open it up. This one is used, so there is no new product today. And because I had some Fermicon clones that are pretty new, so what are we going to get? So first of all, it comes with the same crappy controllers. Yep. Oh my God, look at it. Look at this. <laughs> but they moved the circle on the square. <laughs> oh, those Chinese, oh man, they're so naughty. But they're so funny at the same time. All right, we're getting a power supply and this is an AC 100 volt, so I can't use it. So I need to get myself a universal power supply. I always recommend just grab yourself a new power supply in universal. Um, here we have the AV out, the system itself. Let's see what we have here. The connector, reset, power. Oh, it can't get cheaper than this. The AV out port or AV out, the controller port at the front. Oh, that is really convenient. It's stuck in here. Can I get it out? I think I need to get myself a tool to get it out. Let's see if I can get it. <laughs> and here we have the input for the power itself. Here's some details on the bottom. Seriously, somebody putting a telephone number on this thing. What the hell? All right, so let's get myself a tool and let's try to fix it. Waka, 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 waka. Let's see, let's pull it out. If I'm lucky, I can get, I can get it out. I can get it out. I can't get any grip on it. Oh, uh, oh uh, no. This is a problem. Ah, I got it out. All right, let's grab myself a new cable. This is, this is basically the cable that came with it. Let's see. Yep, indeed. So I need to grab myself a new cable. Nevertheless, I have some stock, so... <sighs> that is what we call very naughty. Alright, people. So booting up the system, this is what we're going to get. The 30-in-1 multi-game card. <laughs> the old-school 90s sound. Alright, so the controller, it's very tiny. But I must say, it feels very comfortable. Sky Zone. Look at his happy face. I want to have the star. No. Whoa, that's messed up. All right, so let's try whale number two. Whoa, that sound is not good. Whoa, and a lot of interference. Seriously? So I'm a whale? Destroying the dolphins. Who made this game? Oh, and shooting sharks. Yeah, all right. I think this guy was on... on yeah. All right, so this thing is filled up with these weird games. I'm guessing Pipe Link is more like this uh, game that you need to connect the pipes. Yep. I did play some of these games before. Yeah. That is the only thing that's happening. Uh, nothing. We having Bomb King. I'm guessing this is Bomberman clone? What the? 
Oh, I think it's more like the strategic game or... Yeah. Alrighty. So what is really funny that there is a quite some difference in sound levels with the games. And some are not even working. Transmission. Okay, what the hell what is happening there? <sighs> what is happening to the sound? So it's basically like a puzzle game. That's it. The soundtracks. Oh man, how creative are you when you're making soundtracks like this? So from this point on, I can't take it anymore. So let's try and just a Famicom game and let's see if this thing even runs. For example, I have this baseball game. Let's see if it runs. <sighs> yeah, I know. We normally don't need to blow the card when I don't have a Q-tip to clean it. And I don't want to grab a Q-tip. I just want to try the game. Let's see if it even works on this thing. No, it doesn't even work. All right, let's grab game number two. All right, so game number two doesn't even get any image or there is no... Yoo-hoo! Stupid thing. All right, so let's play Super Mario on this thing. Let's see. What was the toggle button? Works like a charm. I would say the image quality is not the best. And the controller plays very well. <sighs> and sometimes I'm just trying to boot up the game. This is what happens. Random. Alright, let's try another game. Wow, the sound is really bad. I think it's more like a problem with the connector itself. Alright, let's play a little bit. I really like this game, fun to play. Come on. Works like a charm. So if the game boots up, it works pretty... It works fine, and if you look at the image quality, it's not bad at all. Alright, let's try another one. Whoa, 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 what just happened? What just happened? Come on. Here it goes. Freshman dance, people! Yeah, make it! I made it, I made it, I made it. So that's so strange that sometimes it just randomly boot it, reboots. What the hell is going on with this? I really love this soundtrack. Right, so the play computer. What do I think of this thing? It's not. Control, can you just stay like this? Yes. So, let's put it this. Let's put it like this. But what I wanted to say is that if you look at the play computer, I have really no clue why you even want to buy this thing. Uh, it's more like maybe, wait, I know, maybe it's more like a collectible, because if you play with it, you can already see in the video a lot of problems, glitches, 
and it even randomly boots up, reboots. What the hell is going on with this bloody thing? Nevertheless, the controller is the best part of the system. I really like it. It lies very well in the hand. The buttons itself, as you look at this. Oh my god, it's so cheap, but still it plays very well. So this is what you're going to get. Cheapo NES Famicom thing. I would say just buy original stuff and just avoid these things or you just need to collect them. This is what you're going to get. Thank you for watching. I would say subscribe to the channel. Would be cool. Have you here in the Wicked family. And I will see you in the next video.